All right, guys. It's a bird and I here today. We got ourselves a uh, little bit of a rollover. Guy in a container chest in here. Turn just a little too fast. I'll put all of them out. Get his pants black off the back low. We're gonna just snatch it low and then we're gonna let him pull off the other I'll grab a chain from the other side. Alright, let's get this side or that side? Huh? That's the side, right? Uh yeah, no, I would do right here. But then we'll just grab right there and we'll just drag it low. Probably put one on the other side too, bird. You heard? We got Dave coming to just assist with roll over portion of it. Oh. We're gonna need another chain more than likely just for a precautionary. We're gonna need two more chains. Nope, I put the two frame chains over there. We're gonna need another snatch block too. The next one, do the other one, other one after that. Low. We're 
just doing this. We're just going to uh, the snatch block there and then you're gonna wrap a chain low on that here should be able to just pull it pretty easy make that tighter though So go around. Yeah. this one out watch out watch out all right go ahead let the blue one out a little bit bird I'm just gonna go down with the boom nope Unless we should actually try to rehook it back up. Let's try to rehook it back up. So you can leave that chain there. We'll just swing it around. See if we connect it? Yeah, see if we can. Huh? You ain't gonna be able to push it back. Uh-uh. No way. It, no. It's so twisted though. But it wouldn't be bad an idea to get it to a twist back. Yeah, but you'd have to get a snatch block up top. Yeah, get a snatch block up on that side, up on that corner. We'll just winch that corner right to it. Cause look, this locks out. This locks in. No, it's good. 
You guys are gonna wanna offload this thing, obviously, I'm assuming? Yeah, probably. Okay. I just don't, I didn't look at those tires on that, on that. I know, I'm pretty sure the one's fucked. Yeah, yeah, it looks like one's pretty bad, yeah, so. No matter what, it's more than likely gonna have to go on the new chassis. We're just debating whether or not, I mean, we can try to put the chassis back on and try to overturn so that it's easily movable cool. instead of just taking yeah. it all apart and then letting it sit here until, Got you know, you guys can get a trailer or we can get a trailer He would be the guy to talk over. about that. Just for the time being, are we able to allow people out of here? Yeah, I, I mean, most definitely. I mean, if you want, I, I'll, I'll grab this right now because we can work. I'm, I'm having another rotator come here, so we can work blocking that, and then I can sit right there. So if you're trying to let, like, truck traffic out, well, I can scoot this over, I can drag it over, and you can, can definitely let traffic through. I mean, because we're not going to yeah, be in the way. we just stopped them for a second because they were just starting to move it, and God forbid okay. something were to happen. Okay. So it was like for like 10 minutes, we were like, we're just going to stop. We, I know we told one guy, hey, stop for right now because we're moving everything. Okay. So. We got we got lunch at eleven. Okay. Which is gonna be probably twenty thirty cars trying to get out of here. Yeah. Yeah. Do you have any idea what your time frame is gonna be? Uh, I mean, my, my other truck's coming from Crest Hill, and that was right when I got here. I called him, so I can imagine he'll be here any minute. And like I said, I can grab this corner and I can pull it closer, the whole thing closer to me. Okay. So it makes it a lot easier for traffic to flow. Okay. I mean, that's not a problem. We'll put cones out will so people know. A, and will stuff. there be a short window then when both of you are hooked up to it? Yeah. Get it Once, back upright where yep. you don't want, probably don't want anyone coming through here. Uh, I mean, honestly, since we're gonna have two rotators, it's not gonna. It's not gonna phase me. I'll cone off the sex. I'll cone off what we'll need, so and then you guys will be able to. You don't foresee having to walk this off the floor. No. Any kind of no. No. I'm gonna hook up right here, and I'm gonna, like I said, I'm gonna drag it closest to me. We're gonna try to, we're gonna actually try to just reconnect the two, and then when the other truck gets here, we'll flip it up. Because if not, then we're gonna have to either wait for you guys to get a chassis available, or we're gonna have to get a chassis down here to be able to pick this trailer back up off the ground. Okay. So. How far over do you need to drag it? Uh, I mean, I can drag it at least to this to where we can get it hooked up and then I mean that's gonna give you extra four or five feet on that side So and I'll put my cones right next to it And again, that's just for us to connect it and then I can even drag it even further over to where it's you know more so over here Here bird, let's uh Let's get this Let's get the drag winch hooked up to there right there. Yeah, I'm gonna just free spool it right now I just free spool it That's probably good. And then we're gonna unhook this one too, bird. Can you unhook that blue one? Please? Hold on. Bird, watch out of there, please. Yeah. Is it digging that up right there? No. You want me? To, you want to try to shove a piece of wood under there? Right there, guys. Cool. Oh, that's fine. We'll just put this cone right here. Cause I can move up. Let's try to get these connected real quick. So let's just... 
I'm gonna just spin over. We're just gonna grab this side and we're just gonna push it that way. Cause I could probably chain there. Chain it there, chain that snack I can probably, over there. Car. Listen, I can probably chain there and just we can hook right here and wrap it and it's just gonna fold it. Let's do that. We can let go of that green chain right there. Well, actually, I'll leave that one on there right, so in right, case right, we gotta so pull it too. Up, so I wanna snatch black right to there, from there. All right, so with the chain, chain with there. the chain coming around here. Chain on both sides, to this snatch side. black up there. A chain down here to here that wraps around to there so it folds it to it and then we'll suck the bottom in and then we'll try to lock it. Right. But we need to fold that up so we don't break that. And we can use a frame chain up there too. Here, give me the other end. Huh? Give me the other end. Alright, now I'm going to use this snatch block right here. Pull that cable down. Well, hold on, the snatch, the snatch block's gonna come snatch up here. Block. Yeah, I just wanted to go so here, really, need a long one. to there. No, this is a short one right there. I'll grab it. Yeah, I'll grab it. But that's the thing. With that chain, you're not going to be able to use it. You want the frame chain then? Because you're not going to be able to hook that chain around it. I'll get the other one. All right. Huh? Yeah, it doesn't have to be a really big chain. It just really has to be... It doesn't have to be a super big chain. That's long. Yeah, first one. This one? Yeah. Is the shorter one? Short one. This is fine. Because it ain't heavy. Hey, you want to move that closer to over here? Okay. You want to move that closer to over here? We'll see. You might have to run my white line. Run the snatch block that way. What do you mean? Yeah, that way. Something over there. Pull this side that way. See? We just need to get it. 
We just need to get it down a little bit more and it will be on. So we need to run another chain. I thought that was going to be good enough. Now we just need to switch that snatch block. I just don't like this right here. How oh, that's barely holding on right there. Because if that thing snaps down, it's gonna hurt. Here, I should, uh, I wish. Of course, my cable's not going to come down either. I can use my side puller once, probably. Let's get a ratchet real quick. Ratchet? Ratchet, Yeah, ratchet. You know what I'm saying? If we can hook, hook a hook to the fifth wheel and ratchet bind it shut. You know what I'm saying? Is Dave here yet? Yeah, Dave's here right now. Look, Dave's here right there. Huh? We just really need to get a ratchet binder on it, Bert. I think if we get a ratchet binder on it. Hey, we're just going to connect it. We'll slide it over. Be careful. Come over here. Because that's not, that's about to pop. Huh? Yeah, I, we already got the truck disconnected and everything. Come over? No, the hook is right there. That's why that's that, huh? Yeah, that's why I twist it. This side wasn't even hooked, any blue tires. But I want to get it hooked because then they're not going to be able to move it if we don't hook it. Uh huh? That's what I was trying to do with that. But I need almost to run another line. Yeah, to pull it this way. Right. Jay, I got it. Well, this is what we'll do, Bird. We'll run a chain from right here. We'll get the snatch block right here with my side puller winch. Then it'll pull right there. Yeah, but we're trying not to block this. So if you want to pull up right here. No, because we're going to go one at one. At, we'll do one at the end. So we'll just both grab one end and just. Yeah, in the street with the boom sideways. No, no, because we'll drag it. Listen, all I want is a chain. Let's get a chain right here. A long enough chain. We'll put a snatch block. Doesn't have to be the red one. We'll put a snatch block so it's right here. And then we'll just grab that corner right there and pull it with the snatch block with my side puller winch. Huh? Yeah, the locks the locks work. I already checked them. That's what I'm saying. I want to lock it in and then we'll roll, we'll flip it over. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you don't need this that time? No, we might. We might still need that. Yeah, a long red chain and then a snatch block. Yeah, because it just slides. So this will be sitting like flat up against it. So it's already in the night, so uh, right form. It doesn't lock in at all? Just huh? on top of it? No, this sits in between the canal, right? but then those locks right there in the corner, they slide oh, into those okay. holes right there. But you want to know what it almost looks like? <laughs> I don't even think that one was locked like fully. You see like the safety lock thing that goes over it? I don't think it was like that. All right. 
Jay, can you get your ladder? Cause yeah, we'll wrap this with the chain. No, let him grab the ladder real quick. I'm not gonna use it. I can get up there probably. I can just crawl up there. Yeah, I already got it out. Well, I'm, uh, once I get it hooked up, then we're gonna hook you up to the ass end and we're gonna rotate the whole thing over. I just really wanna get... No, cause I'm, we'll, we'll straighten it out and then... Huh? I know, you just wanna be in a hurry. Uh, <laughs> All right, here. Yeah, here. Perfect, bird. I could probably just. Uh, and then we could do another loop over here. Yeah, bring it over, anyways. That's probably long enough, bird. So hook it here, let me see the chain. Let me see the one chain. It might not be long enough. Because we're gonna want it to go to here with a snatch block hooked up. So hook it tight right here. Hook it like on that one. This, yep, no, no, that one. That one. All right, see, and then we'll put the snatch block right here. All right, let's get it. All right, you gotta go now. All right. Dave Ponzi's got a ladder. I don't get, my truck don't get the ladder. It's kind of jacked up if you ask me. Is it locked? Huh? Well, my, it's, I just never used it. I mean, I've yeah, used it once. Like yeah. We got another chain? Huh? Why? No, you just hook it right there and then I'll, I'll winch it and then we'll hold it up. need nothing bigger than this chain right here. Did you get messed up though? Fix that chain. Yeah, I know. Here, I'm gonna look. Can you fix it? We can just let that one out. It's on there. Yeah, but look at that hook. So just let it out then? No, tighten it if anything. You know what I'm saying? So let me pre spool this. So we can pull it and tighten it so we can get it to spin more. That's probably 
I get this hook it to one of those. And then we gotta get this big chain out of the way here. do that because I don't want to pull it that way. But I do want to pull it that way though. I know, I see it. That's why I'm trying to keep this tight too. No, you're going to have to sledgehammer it down. Get the sledge out. Sledgehammer? Yeah. Ooh, be careful, bird. Spring open? No, that's why I got I that. So even if it were to, it's not going to. I mean, even if it wanted to, I should say. But see, that's the thing. I should actually try to let off with the yellow one a little bit. Hold on one second, Bert. I'm going to try to let off with the yellow one. Huh? I really want to let that one out completely. Move that hook off of there. So then it pulls it downward. All right, there we go. Sorry. Hold on, bird. Hold on. What? Yeah, you got to hit it down. You got to get on top and hit it down. Let me see this. There you go. Don't hit your foot. Keep going. Keep going, it's going. It's like almost there, so. There you go. It's gotta come this way. I did loosen that one, look. I can't anymore. Oh, I can. Never mind. Never mind, Bert. You, you proved me wrong. You might be able to just tap this in right well, it's now. Well, because we knocked it down a little bit. I think that's why I fucking we were able to suck it off. It's got to go down a tad bit more, dude. Just a tad bit more. Just a tad bit more. Hit it. There you go. All right, we gotta get that one up there. I got it, Ty. You got it in? Bet. Here comes the test of tests. Watch out. <laughs> yeah, because look it. Alright. Sorry, bird. She's free.
Yeah. Huh? Uh, yeah, I'm probably gonna, I'll probably pull it over just a little bit. You're gonna move it, right? Huh? You're gonna move it on? Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to pull it over. Just, I'm gonna suck it over just a little bit more. Hey, this is a. Did it look at? Did we notice that this whole tandem just broke? It dripped off. I didn't even pay attention to that. Fuck. I didn't realize this is all completely ripped off. Oh no shit. Yeah. Yeah. No, ripped off. The whole thing's completely ripped off. Well, we'll. I mean, we'll try to get it tipped up to at least Holy set down shit. on there. Push that on the first. Hey, you should see this. Wow. Yeah, but these pins ain't gonna go nowhere, Dave, so that's not. I... You're gonna name, right? It's just like. Yeah. Probably gonna try to put these flipping on it and It'll be on YouTube. It'll be good. I put everything on YouTube <laughs> usually, so. So, what do you guys think is best? Should we just make this fight? Guy get a fucking uh, chassis out here from his company? I mean, I, mean, I, I want to make it safe for you guys, too. Yeah, I mean, uh, no matter what, it's gonna. This chassis freaking shot. It's so, hey, we can do it. It's gone. Well, it yeah, we can, we can, we can throw it on. We can get it to where it's safe enough to you guys get it in and get it unloaded. Okay. And then, I mean, then they can worry about transporting it and everything from there. Oh yeah, yeah. That's what I was trying to point out with Daniel and everything. It was, it was fucked. Yeah, I didn't notice that when yeah, I got here. Um, I think because it was so twisted, I, I just thought it was all still connected. So. Yeah. So. Uh, I, I don't know like what their plan was. I know that you guys have like uh, frames and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, but well, he thinks they could be they'll be able to get it up and over where we can at least get it in and yeah, unload it. Dock door and load it. Unload like we'll it. secure it with chains and ratchet binders and all that stuff right now. Yeah. And then I mean even if well, we have to cage the, the brakes or whatever. The product isn't going to get unloaded by us. We're going to refuse it. Oh, okay. It's a, it's right. A tip load. Well then so, we'll probably be the ones that end up come out here and do it again. Something. I I don't know how that. Uh, hopefully it's at least not. Usually they're not on pallets in these damn things. Last time it was it a thing of Oreos. Yeah, I don't think it would be on pallets. And we had to hand undo all of that. Too. Yeah. Um, DOT bar still attached, so yeah. Yeah, yeah right. We can't, um, we can't receive it if it's fucked up. Yeah, you don't know what it looks like inside. The weight could have crushed the half of the load. I mean, he says it's got a full load. He says it's got 48,000 in there, so it's... Oh, yeah. I, I don't want any of our spotters around. Yeah, no, I wouldn't. I would not, no. Right. I, I Definitely not. I want this thing, like, uh, out of here. Like, you know what I mean? I mean, I... I can we can upright it and I mean if we have to move it we I, we can move it most right. definitely I'm not gonna That's have I, would, I can't have I him move it yeah I can't have him move no. it I mean because obviously the state of it is if um, anything happens again you know maybe this time because the pins are actually locked it might take the truck with it so right right um, right so you know my my thoughts is uh do like what you say try yeah. to get this thing bound to it however mm -hmm. and uh try to start setting it up and I'll get in contact with Daniel and my boss to see what they want to do with this yeah what, you know, do you guys have, well, I mean, even if they wanted to get, like, say, another chassis or another whole another trailer, I mean, if we had to, we could back them up and, then, you know, they could worry about doing the, the trans load and then towing this thing wherever the hell it needs to go. And, right. I mean, because you guys said it yourself, you're going to refuse the load, more than likely. I mean, yeah, I don't, I don't see They don't them. really refuse much around here. Yeah, well, I mean, it's tipped over in their lot. So, yeah, yeah you can imagine. That come in before. We've seen trailers come in with, that get hit by tornadoes. Yeah. They still bring it in. From there, it'll go somewhere else. Right, right. Yeah. The, the yeah, so it's like a. For. Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. Well, so you guys will account for it and then obviously we'll refuse it or send it back or. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah. I'll, I'll yeah. go grab those guys so we can get shit still. Okay, going. I'm going to go ahead and start ratchet bomb because that's a plan yeah. of attack. We're still just going to bind it up. Our point of being here is to get this thing upright and get yeah. it out of the way so you guys can fucking open this up so you're not. Because back there, yeah, that's, that's the big concern. I mean, in all honesty, like, I, I, I would hope that it would be just great to just sit it on the fucking road and yeah. like, carrier. Yeah. Your problem. Mm -hmm. you yeah. So, but I doubt that's yeah. the way. Well, I mean, I mean, by all means, we can, we can, we yeah. can put and it I, on the street I think for I'm, you. I'm like in the clouds out there. Yeah. No, they'll, they'll let it sit here. Yeah. They'll, yeah, they'll let us. Trucks park here all the time. 
I think they would let us here. It's just we wouldn't be able to leave it with knowing if he would take it or not. Right. You know, because we couldn't let him go down the road with it. But regardless, yeah. that's at another time. We'll get it ratchet binded on and then we'll get this thing rolled over we'll real get quick. The people that get paid more to make the decision on where it's going to go. Cool. Sounds good. All right, let's just get a ratchet binder. You got some ratchet binders, or you only got one now, right? Yeah, I only got one. You're a liar, dude. You're trying to always say yeah, I took all yours. Some. Hey, my vi a video, no, a video is going up online. You can see. Yeah, hey, good. you can see why but we used. We, you can see why we used mine because we used yours, and I couldn't get it to grab onto the thing. No, we couldn't. That was we took off by that. Huh? I took the one that was sitting out in front. Remember, I put it inside the truck. What? You know what the other side? No, I'm talking about the air fitting thing that you were oh. trying to say that I was that well, stole no, I from you. One, I know. I, I, that's I, what I'm saying. One, that's so why we use mine because I yours, I couldn't get yours to get grab it. Where did mine go? That's what I'm saying. Check your buddy it Rob. should be there. Ask Rob or John. There was the only two that was in the truck. Hey. All right, let's ratchet bind this on. You want me to? Uh, I would try. The other side and push it over real quick while I'm flushing the ratchet the side. Your chain over there is on the, stuck under there. That chain on the Which one? Is it? Yeah. I'll just lift it up a little bit right there. And then we'll get it out. No biggie. You want it back off or you just leave it? Huh? Back well, off. let me see if when I pull it this way, let me see if it does it. Because if it does... You want to go up there, Jay? Can you hook that blue one back up there? Go up there, I'll give you the blue one real quick. Cause I don't want to lift it without that. Hey, how much nicer are your outriggers now that you can just... That one guy? Yeah, sorry, hold on. things down. Can you lift it? Good? Ah, there goes my hook. That's why it's nice to have those freaking clips on. Grab that chain out of there. You ready? You still need to hook up? No, I mean, we'll probably hook it up a different way, but. Whoa. Watch your whip. Ooh, I almost got you. <laughs> All right, let's get this drag disconnected. Or bam! Let's get this. Hey, let's get uh, let's get this drag winch disconnected, and then I'll slide it over just a tad bit more, so that we're kind of straightened out. You should actually go over there so you can slide it over, so that we're not worrying about this curb. Well, that's what I'm saying. I'm going to slide this way. You can slide that way. So it kind of right here. Actually, leave that right there. Leave that right there. I don't even know why I'm saying that. 
Just pull up a little bit so we can pull yours over. You want to just you just want to position right now you just want to flip around and position right now yeah i would just back up at an angle right here i think he'll be able to pull pull up right here and just back up a little bit same angle of it so that when you pick it up it doesn't go like this huh no 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 like as if you're gonna come right here at an angle and you're gonna boom over and pick it up yeah so you're gonna pull up right here so your ass ends just past the trailer so when you pick it up it'll be center of your boom so you don't have a shit ton of swing Yeah, but you want to be angled the same angle as the trailer. So you want to be parallel with the trailer this way. No, your boom's going to be center of the trailer. I don't want you all the way up here. So just pull up right here with your, like, this tire right here. Yeah. But you get... Well, that's fine. I would get further away, but... Turn that way. Alright, you want it like that, but like a foot and a half over. You want to be just like this, but a foot and a half over. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to get position now. Or should we, hey, we should probably swing it. We should probably pull it over a little bit, no? Hey, would you feel more comfortable being straight in the lane? Cause see, look where your boom's at now. You see what I'm saying? So when you spin completely 90 to it, you're gonna wanna be a little bit over, more center over this, cause we're just gonna go, ooh, you know, and then you'll be center of it. So that when we fully pick it up, we don't have it go like this. Swing on us. Even though we both have plenty of equipment to hold it, you know? Let's get this disconnected real quick. This is free. Uh, no, because what we'll do is we'll use this as a catch line. So we'll pick with this line with a long chain and then we'll grab the other side 
So when we're tipping it, we're holding it with that. I mean, we could use that chain. We could use that. That's fine by me. No, but what are you gonna hook up there? No, we can right? use this one. So we'll use this one. That's good. You're, you got a good point. So we'll use this one right here. Yeah. He's gonna come out, he's making a call with our like big manager for Mondelez or whatever. Uh -huh. um, but what it sounds like, we are gonna refuse it. We don't okay. want anything to do yeah. with it. Um, and they're gonna think of where it can go. Like, I don't know if maybe it can be brought down to TA and they can right. fucking handle it at that point. Or right. where they're gonna wanna, you know, just shit it onto somebody else. Right, right. Uh, we'll take I, it, we can take it. And I, I mean. mentioned like at a uh, small nominal fee, it can yeah. be hand off loaded or something like that yeah. too. So I mean, right. you guys get paid anyway, it looks yeah. like. So, cool. um, but yeah, and you're gonna make sure that that tractor doesn't take it and all that, yeah. right? Yep, that's, cool. that's, that's, cool. Our, that's, one of, that's our only concern here besides then getting I it will, up, right? Then I will get out of you guys fucking way and okay. keep traffic away from you. Cool, me. thank you. All right, so we're just gonna hook the chain and then I want to run a big chain over to that side maybe with a strap or something like the blue strap, the long blue strap? yeah the blue strap to the chain but I don't want the chain I want the chain to be able to come up up past that you get what I'm saying let me see I think Dave's got those really long blue chains that's what I'm saying He's got two of them. Let me get let me get positioned real quick though. Can you get the snatch block off my side puller winch real quick? Please. Pull your winch in. Hold it. Good. You going in? Oh, I got it on preschool. Because when I put them, I, one time I put them in down here to hold the, this leg from folding up because I couldn't get it to stop folding up, and that's what happened. All right. 
Can you grab that? You, I thought you were going to grab the tandems real quick and try to... No, I, I, I can do that first, but I got... Alright, so this is going to be our plan of, an action, uh, of action. We're, you got the long blue, big long blue chains, right? Yeah. You got two of those really long ones. So we're, I don't have any of those. So we're going to use your blue chains, and we'll use my those chains right there. And we'll throw a D-link in it so it's long enough so it grabs the bottom, okay? So we can pick it up, right? Why are you trying to pick it up from the bottom, though? Because I'm... Well, I'm going to pick... We're going to pick up um, this bottom. And then on that bottom, on that side, so that when you pick it up, when we pick it up like this, we'll we'll get it le elevated in the air, and then we'll let out on this one, so it goes down, and then we'll go up on this one, so then we can just and roll it over. Yeah, we're gonna pick it up in there, and then roll it in the air, and then set it down. You're gonna do the same thing. Yeah, but what we're gonna do is hopefully we're gonna try to put the tandems. We're gonna try to make the, the chain maybe go around those tandems to suck it to it. Yeah. When we lift it. You know what I'm saying? Can I ratchet bind it? I mean, we can ratchet bind it right now, that most definitely. But I just got to get myself in a position real quick. Here's one ratchet binder off of my truck. Yeah. <laughs> I got video proof it came from mine, Dave. Yeah. I got to record everything around you now, trying to steal all my stuff. All right, I'm going to flip her. I'm going to pull up and then center me kind of center, yeah? I should kind of pull it over a little bit more, you think? So we're not so much blocking that way? Or no? Let's get this dragger! Like I said, let me pull up. Let me pull up real quick. Hey, can you move that? Find another spot for it, see how much it's charged. Jaybird he never shuts these doors. Never. So once I pass him, I'll make him shut the door. Bird! Get my door! But I can't block the whole road. We're gonna have to drag it to us. We're gonna have to drag it over.
I'm gonna pull, I'm gonna pull up a little bit. We might have to drag it over to us. You don't have to get underneath it. Oh yeah. No, yeah, we'll pick up. We'll pick up on this side. We'll pick up. We'll, no, yeah, you pick up. We'll throw a piece of wood underneath there. Watch. We'll do it real quick right now. Hey bird, can we get some wood under there? We'll use these pieces of wood to slide underneath there, underneath the edge. We'll be able to put these probably right on each corner once we just pick it up. What's up? Huh? That's good though. Well, or the black top. Look at we could sink through this, especially you gotta think we're putting a lot of weight on the outriggers, plus we're picking up. Yeah, you are. You got a chain up top? 48,000 plus the container. It's 48,000 in the load, yeah, a chain up top. No, hell no. Maybe if you double it up? Huh? Huh? 58. 58? Did you say? 7,000? Yeah. Do you have another cutoff chain like that, Dave? Huh? For the containers, yeah, but not. I don't think they're they're like the pin holes. Not, they're like those holes. Huh? my truck.
we'll see if I can pick it up. Put some water underneath there. He says, hell no, that's because it's doing it all by itself, Dave, the whole thing. Go ahead. Good. Oh, my truck was up. <laughs> we're going to have to hook it, and then like I said, we're going to have to swing it over this way a little bit. Yeah, let's start hooking it. Let's get this chain down. And then we'll run the chain through there. I got it. Why don't you go up on top of it? Go up there because you're going to have to get, hook up other chains and stuff real quick. Cause you're gonna have to hook up one for Dave too. Well, I guess not. Come on. You're gonna have to grab my line down. There. Let me bring you that line. Oh, you can kick it down. Grab that white one though. Is it free? Shoot. Got it. when lunch is because I think I want to pick up all my outriggers and get even with it. How long is it? 11 o'clock, half an hour break. Okay. Luckily, not very many of them go. There you probably have maybe at most 10 cars. Okay. Okay. Because honestly, I'd like to back up a little bit more, but... I'm gonna have to try to suck it a little bit more to me, and he's just gonna have to reposition. Well, I mean, whatever. They're just gonna have to deal with it, cause I don't, I don't care about that. Okay, well then I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna just reposition. I'm gonna back up and get center with it, so that do we can what just. Do gotta do. Cool. I'm gonna just back up a little bit. I'm just backing up. Boom's off the side. Got our outriggers out still. We'll just back her up just a tad bit here.
put the platform on all the way around. I need to. Here, watch out. Please. Side the three under there. Are you guys all locked and ready to roll? No. Alright. Huh? Hey, you want to, uh. Shit, that ain't gonna work, huh? Can you get him out of there now? Cool. What's that noise? just gonna rig up real quick and then I would probably say 20 30 minutes maybe okay, if that yeah, I, I want you to keep doing whatever you can to get it yeah. quickly I just, my guy's going on lunch at 11 I'll yeah. leave so I'll probably tell him take a little later I okay by 11 30 I'll probably oh what time is it right now it's only like 10 30 right 10 45 I'd say probably before 11 30 I mean once the longest part is getting rigged up you know and then once we get it up in the air it's only gonna take two seconds to get it over so and then we'll be able to move you expect this to be cleaned up by 11 30 yeah up right here okay yep. thank cool. you yeah all right, let's get the chains real quick. Huh? What? Yeah. Look down and come back over, and then I can lift it up. That way, it'll squeeze this together. Right now, and then ratchet yeah. bind it, not to lift it. You're not going to lift from there because that's just the frame. That's obviously twisted and compromised. So we want to pick up from the trailer and just let this chassis shit hang. Dude, it is too. It's not even connected. Look, this is off. This is ripped off. It's 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 gonna fall off. Listen, even if it falls off, if we could get the front down, let's do that real quick. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Get your shit ready. Let's go. I told him by 11:30. That's in 35, 40 minutes. Yeah. So let's not procrastinate and get it going. We got another chain like this. All right, so let's get that. Like I said, that's a good idea. We're just gonna do what you just said. Even though it's tipping that hook a little bit. Dave, go out! Keep going out! Alright, go ahead, Winch in, go up!
want to get me rigged up we need to grab his long blue chain like that huh? we need his long blue chain like that because we're gonna hook it to that one right there that? in his front tunnel box keep going dave Let's just get it on, and then if you want, uh, well, if we're secure, I don't know. Uh, yeah, I need that for up front. Yeah, that's this one. Wait, that's not the same one, bro. This chain. Where, where's it at? It's, it's in the front. That's fine. That's fine. No big deal.
Alright guys, there you have it. Bird and I and Dave Ponziani over there in this truck. We uh, rolled this truck over, or I'm sorry, this trailer. Uh, Dave wasn't here to uh, rehaul. He showed up to reconnect the chassis a little bit later. Uh, it was connected to that tractor right there, which I'm sure you guys know. This is actually all ripped up under here. The tandems are off. We had to chain them up. Get a good look at Dave, the other operator there. Dave, you want to say anything to the YouTube fans out there? That was a good job. Well, you're, yeah, there's people out there that like Dave. Some people like you, some people hate you. What do you know, right? All right, guys. Well, there you have it. We did it yet again. Uh, the two rotators, 1140 and 1150. Here's that 50, a little on the dirty side. Here's that 40. Of course, she's on the clean side. That's because the Jaybird and I drive it. But regardless, we'll catch you guys on the next one. As always, hopefully you stayed entertained on this job. Thanks a lot for watching.